First meeting, 7.30. Oh, I'm ready for Coach Cass meeting. Oh, I'm ready for Jason's meeting. Wake up, stand up, stand up. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Can I get a two clap rack? Three clap rack. Sit down. Like <laughs> I will tell you right now that I lived and died with a good word or a word from my coach when I was growing up. He said, "Hit it, I hit it till I couldn't hit it anymore." And uh, it was encouragement, and I've used that so much through my life. And there's no question that getting to stand here with you today in the role I'm in, or a big part of that. There's a couple of choices I had today. I could come over here, wave, shake, do that kind of thing, and get out. But we could have a little coaching discussion. So we're going to have a coaching discussion. So dig in. You guys are changing lives. You're making impacts on lives not only now, but for a long, long, long time. And it's an exponential impact because they're going to go out into the world and they're going to remember what you said, consciously or subconsciously, and it's going to come out. What you're teaching them right now is going to affect them now for the rest of their lives and many other people. We're doing God's work. It's the greatest profession there is. As you go into the season this year, everybody tries to establish an identity. You have to have an identity to your system and to your philosophy. What's an identity? It's really simply being known for something. You want to be known for running the ball. You want to be known for being a great pass offense. You want to be known for having great ball security. Whatever that is, whatever you want to be known for, emphasize it. The player reflects you and your teaching. That's a, that's a high standard. Okay? And develop the man. Then the player comes.